Hi guys, today I'm going to be doing a little YouTube video here on how to install a Proto SCS. Yeah, let's get on to it. What you're going to need threadless fork with a star knight in, mine's integrated. I've got two things integrated, which is pretty cool. We'll see your Crown Racy headset. Pretty lucky, lucky SMX forks. The SCS, obviously, Proto. I'm using Proto. There's loads of different ones like Apex, um, Blazer Pro, which I used to ride, but they're not the legitest. Um, yeah, there's loads of other ones. Inverting that. Your bars with no slit whatsoever. You have to cut. If there is, then like you can just go to your nearest Dollarama or Poundland to get one. Like, just cut off the end. Uh, your threadless headset, I'm because my deck's integrated, I'm using the district integrated headset. It's so good. Highly recommend the deck headset, like all district stuff. And I highly recommend these forks, they're amazing. Okay, so step one. You're gonna wanna put your forks into the head tube. Make sure your bearings are in obviously. Make sure your compression compression ring, that's the silver bit that goes around it. I'm moving right now. Make sure that's in there. If it isn't, then the compression system won't work properly. And if you turn it up a little bit, it just won't spin. Your, you don't need this, but it is better to have the dust cap thingy on. Dust protector, I think it's called. It just looks cool, really. <laughs> um, after you've done that, you're going to want to, as you can see, like that, this is if you need spaces or not. If you need, this is how you, this is the test. See if you need spacers. And you put SCS on. Obviously, put make sure the star nut things inside with the shim. Take the bolt out. And then clamp it down like that. If it, if the shim doesn't rise up at all, then you're not going to need spacers. But if it rises up, then just buy some spacers or get some spacers off your bike or something. And then just keep on testing it until it just, the shim doesn't move. You can either do that, or before you put in your star knight, you can just cut your forks down. Yeah. So now that you put your SCS on, well, I've I've um, stretched it. That's it. That's near. Um, just gonna quickly get my five. Okay, so I've just done stretched it. Just taking out the bolt now. If your bolt isn't big enough to go through, because mine's quite big, then you like if your bolt's not big enough to go through, then you're just gonna have to go to a hardware store and just like get him to fix it for you. They'll probably know what they're talking about. Like that, and then just get your bolt and drop it in. There we go. After you've done that, you're gonna wanna get your five mil whatever end your bolt is and tighten it up. Okay, once it's moderately tight, like just about nearly tight, it's gonna wanna just tighten it up as tight as it gets. It's getting tight now. Yeah, that's tight, it's all good. And like that, if everything's like tight, like your wheels and like your bolts aren't moving, then it should be a solid scooter. Don't worry about if it doesn't spin that much, because it'll spin much better with the bars on. Okay, so after you've done it, tighten that up, you want to put your bars in, and then like make sure they're in alignment. look into alignment to me. Once you've done that, you 
always going to want to start tighten it up from the bottom but don't actually tighten it just make sure the bolts inside the actual casing thing then at the top you're always going to want to do that one up first so it pinches the bars because over time when you're scootering the bars slowly come out of the actual SCS make sure they're pinched first and then you can start from the bottom go to the top I use this ratchet it, it 5 mil on it it's just brilliant uh, it, just, it hasn't sheared any of my bolts, not circled them, nothing, and it's just really good. So I'm going to tighten them all up. Okay, so after they're all tight, then you should have no wobble if you've tightened it up good, and your bar should spin quite smooth if you've got a sealed headset, and you should have a solid scooter. Nice. And yeah, it's dialed. Okay. Bye.